My one wish is for Mr. Three to be put in his place this episode. Please just let, let something happen to him. He's too ego. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Buster. I Shinobi. Today we have episode 74 and 75 of our One Piece watch. So we're going to hop right into it. If you're new to the channel, drop a sub and hit that big boy bell. And let's get started with the episodes. So it just comes off of him. He's menacing, dude. Oh my goodness. That sound effect for, the, for it is crazy. Unsuffit. Shut up, dude. Is this gonna light him on fire, pretty much? Yes. Garu, what's up? Uh, Luffy's probably fine. I mean, he's literally stuck under a gigantic. That's just not fair. I don't know how he's gonna get unstuck at this point because the other giant's down too. Oh, that's what he calls it? Kiki bomb? Oh! Disrespect him, Luffy! Oh my! Why did he blow up when he kept- His kicks are explosive too? Okay, Usopp literally looks dead. What the- So does Karu. Bro, is Luffy good? For a second, I was like, maybe that's what he wanted. He wanted him to, like, blow up the thing around them, but it doesn't look like it did. Get up, Luffy! He literally can't do anything. It's up to Zoro and Sanji. Giant's stuck, too, now. That is really powerful. To restrain him? Yeah, how dare he look at you like that after you trap him under wax? No, because it was tampered with. There's no pride in that. Oh, he's realized it now. Yep, I was gonna say, it's gonna get to a point where he realizes it wasn't a fair fight. Oh man, I feel like this is gonna enrage him. So bounties never expire or anything? 200 million is a lot. Oh no, don't blame yourself then. Aww. Dude, they were friends, man. Despite being in a fight to the death every day, they were friends. Because it wasn't like that. Yeah, Vivi's locked down. Disrespectfully so, too. Oh, wait, Zoro is trapped, too. Is Sanji? Oh, my gosh. Bro, is he going to burn the entire island to the ground? Okay, this is genuinely impressive, though. Oh my goodness, it's enormous! That's absurd! Okay, they have Zoro and Nami, but yeah, that's right, okay. And they're like, no way, how? And you literally did it yourself, he was trapped! These guys annoy me, man. All these Baroque work egos are, are way too big for my taste. I mean, yeah, they have taken them down to an extent, but not alone. Luffy would wipe the floor with all of them, for sure. Even Mr. Three, I think. Okay, what does it do, though? <laughs> this is Mr. Three's power. What does it do? This is my service set. Refuses to answer any other questions. Wait, really? So they didn't even take away his sword. Wait, Zoro can't cut through that? I guess he said it's hard as iron when it's solid. Oh! That is like psychotic. Well, they're just like slowly covered in wax like that? I feel like probably does have to be the key to this. He's like, he's gonna be so mad that the whole thing was ruined like this. He's gonna make him mad. He's just sitting there quietly. He has to be like boiling up. What? What? Yeah. There was. That's why he cried after. Yeah. Yeah, what would you know? You fight all sleazy. Dang, it was like he was showing him the respect he deserved. Let's go! Yes! Ferdori! He's still outmatched, but he has the rage of a lion. No, dude. No! Get up! Usopp is looking rough. 
He's digging him out. Look at that determination. This bird is the MVP of this arc right now. I swear. He is absolutely cracked. Homie wouldn't give them up whenever he was captured. He's digging Luffy out. Oh my gosh. So it's not going to be up to for Bragi. Handcuffs. Dude, he's enraged him. The fact that someone broke out of his wax is probably something he's never seen before. Oh no. He's just going to come. Oh. oh my God. There's no chance he's breaking out now. They need Luffy Usopp. They're going to come riding in on Kadu like freaking knights in shining armor. It's such a slow death. That is so gross. Ugh. Mm. After all that, yeah. Mm -mm. This is justified with that anger, dude. A hundred years for it to all end like that. I, it's just, that's unbearable. Zoro doesn't even look worried, bro. He can't do anything. <laughs> what? Oh! He said, guys, I, I kind of have to. <laughs> I'm shocked they didn't take his swords. I love Zora's attitude, though. He's like, hey, you can still move. I can still move. Let's do this. So what does uh, she do? I forgot her name. Like, Mr. Three's partner. She, does she just eat? She's like his assistant? Dude, I love the light the light like taps in the background i think it's that thing spinning but yes sir that's what i like to hear <laughs> that face that looks somewhere oh shoot how you don't have swords to cut yourself out yes <laughs> Oh my god! A simple miscalculation. The boys are here! Kadu will eat you for dinner, baby! <laughs> it's good timing, because we're all inspired here, too. Oh, you're in for it, dude. What a weird head! Luffy is just so straightforward, dude. <laughs> so dumb. Oh! Dude, Zoro's just too cool, man. I want him to just snap it, man. Like, one hit, snap it. <laughs> Usopp's like, I'm feeling pretty good about myself right now. All right, now we have ourselves a fight. Now it's going down. I am ready. Episode 75, let's get it. It's like they use the sound effect of it in the soundtrack and it works so well. It's like kind of build attention. Dude, Karu looks ready to fight. <laughs> He's so cheeky, man. I thought he was cutting himself out. I thought it was just like he was like bleeding from cutting himself out. <laughs> so it just didn't work out? Vivi's like, these guys are crackheads. <laughs> True. It's like they know deep down that they'll get out of it. Yes, it is. I'm ready for Luffy to put Mr. Three in his place, though. Like, he's just... I feel like people just underestimate Luffy because he's just so normal looking. <laughs> He's probably so frustrated that they're not freaking out. Yeah. <laughs> he, like, he said he likes to see like the fear and pain on their faces. What did he realize? Yeah? Not scared in the slightest? Oh, true. This is going to be the, like, Mr. Three fighting, like, head on. Uh, up until now, he's had to be more sneaky and trickery. Now he's just straight up 1v1. He is a rare figure. Dude, Usopp riding Kadu? That is sick. Look at Kadu's face. He is ready. Showtime. Time to perform, boys. Oh, preparations. They planned for this. Or was he just being cheesy and he, like, he just was scared? Don't undo Usopp's bravery arc. 
Luffy better not get trapped right away. Just take it and punch it. <laughs> He's intrigued. Luffy, please. Perfect for what? Oh, to break them out? Oh, he said like a mallet. Wait, actually though. <laughs> He's gonna spin right into the tower. He's reaching Mach 10. Boom. Genius. Wait, that's gonna fall on them. I like Zoro's face. Just like, yeah, he did. I, this is what I was saying. It's gonna fall on him. Just kill him instantly. Oh no, they're chilling. It was a perfect hit. Not even close. <laughs> His little laugh. Wait, it's still spinning? Eh? Oh no. It's hard to breathe just looking at it. How is it still spinning? Luffy! He thinks he thought they were just chilling. Ay, ay, ay. Yes, they were they were just joking. It was just a joke. Luffy, you better act fast, bud. Usopp, where are you? The problem is Luffy has several things to focus on. Them, like, getting the wax on them, but also he can't just rescue them because they'll just attack him. Now he understands. Harpoon? There you go, Usopp! Yes! Oh, he's taking the hit! What? How does that work? Oh, he's immune to explosives? I guess since his boogers are explosive and he, his kicks are explosive, it would make sense. Is he just made of gunpowder? That is absurd. Dang, I thought that was going to be a direct hit on Mr. Three. Who saw me start like shooting explosive stars at the thing? I don't know, something. Yes, there you go, bud. He's powerful, but he, he like I said, a one track mind. It takes him a second. Oh, it blocked him. Oh, man. He said, why'd you do that? Oh, he got him again. I think Luffy wants it. Yeah, he can use it as another mallet. You fool. It's gonna break the wall. Oh, no. Uh, I guess when Luffy broke the thing, he had like crazy amounts of speed. Still works though. The fist. Yes! He actually got a hit on him. Oh, that's gonna, that's either gonna make him really mad or just like take him down a notch. Okay, Luffy, you gotta break it. You gotta figure it out. I mean, I think his best option is to grab them and just try to pull. What do you mean, no? What are you talking about? He's being like sarcastic, but I don't understand why. Oh, now we see what she does. Now she comes into play because I guess because Mr. Three was sort of uh, taken down for a second, she has to step in. I thought she had to be more than just like his assistant or whatever. Like she's one of the miss whatevers. I forget what she was, but she's reached this position for a reason. Colors trap. Oh, she's probably the one making him say that. Like she's like has him under a spell or something. Yeah, there's something on his feet or under his feet. Yeah, it's like a, I don't know, some kind of trap. Her spell just demotivates him? It completely like neutralizes you. Come on, put it together, Usopp. Please. That's very powerful. He's just standing there wide out in the open. Oh no. And didn't Broggy say he could still kind of move? I thought he was gonna try to bust out too. Are they gonna explain it to him? <laughs> it's paint. Oh, didn't they say she was like the painter or like assistant painter or something like that? That's why I thought he was a painter originally, but he's wax, she's paint. Good dodge. I mean, you know what he does now. You can try to evade it. Her laugh is starting to drive me insane. Not escape. They need to help Luffy. Oh, maybe he is. I think he's just trying to get them out of there and like away from the battlefield so they can't help. Ryan Garu! Oh, <laughs> there's no time. God dang, Usopp is moving. Colors trap, betrayal. Oh, like he betrays. Oh, it is like a, just like a spell. Did she plant that before? Or did he step like, and she, he just stepped on it? Or did this like her paint move and stuff? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I don't want to be mean to Luffy, but he is simple minded. Oh, you said one strike, my he wears his heart on his sleeve. Oh, smart. Because they'll want to betray them. They'll want to do the opposite of what she's saying. That's pretty smart. Wow. Yeah. Hell yeah, Vivi. 
He's back. No, run. Now we find out if she can like move the paint or if. Okay, tell him not to step forward. Oh, yep. There she goes. Oh, she gave him laughter or joy. Now it's on him. What is he supposed to do? That's really powerful. <laughs> Nami's face. Dude, laughing like really, really, really hard for an extended period of time would like I legit hurt after a while. I love Zoro's posing though. Usopp needs to loop back around. Have to, oh, yep, there they are. Oh, and they're gone. Okay. Oh, they ran into him. Oh, it has to be that pattern. Oh. Luffy behind you, brother, please. <laughs> I wonder if she's much of a fighter, though. Don't turn your back on her, please. Oh, she can throw it. Okay, she can throw it down, yeah. Take her out, Burst! Oh, it's like attracted. He's like attracted to it. <laughs> That's just disrespectful, dude. <laughs> you need to smudge it or something, buddy. It really isn't. People that nullify him are, are like the opponent's strongest against him. Not just like brute force fighters like like Krieg. Don Krieg lost him because he was just brute force strength. The people that nullify him are the ones that are most effective. Or I got a chance because he nullified him. He threw him into the water with the, the chain. Don Krieg had a chance because he got him in the water. Basically wrapped up. It hasn't been where like Luffy's actually just straight up beat down in a fight. I don't think. But that's because he is very strong. He is very powerful. So they have to find ways to restrain him. Okay, does it have to have a name? It's basically a regular move just twice, like at the same time. I was gonna say, take some shots. You can eat them, but you might as well keep them on their toes. He needs to do a drive-by. Just start, like, shooting as they run by to try to help Luffy. Oh, boy, straight up got just got a gun. That looks sick. That's clean. South blue model. So it's literally just a regular gun. Oh, the bullets are... In okay, so it's definitely not a regular gun. Well, the thing is, do invisible bullets matter? I mean, a gun shoots so fast, it's not like you can, like, see it coming and dodge it. Please don't tell me Usopp gets shot. Are they frozen over? Oh my gosh. It's not too late, Usopp. Make a move. <laughs> He's stuck. He's stuck enjoying this nice tea. Yeah. That has me so frustrated in a fight against two. So Mr. Three turns out to not even be the biggest opponent to Luffy, but Miss, what was it called? Golden Week? Something like all Golden Week? She's actually the one that's actually putting him down because she can nullify him. The most that Mr. Three could do was hope to get some wax on him. But if Luffy got to him, that's that. If she has the possibility of straight up just like putting him under this trance, something that he can't break out alone, then I mean, what can you do? It's another one of those things where he has to rely on his crew to help him. And now it's up to Usopp because the rest of them are literally covered in wax. I think they'll be okay if they can break them out. Like they, they may still like have room in there where they can breathe inside. But I mean, you have such limited oxygen if it's that tight of a container. But guys, that's been it for episode 74 and 75 of our One Piece Watcher. The battle is heating up, really coming to sort of a climax here. I guess we will see how it's going to end up with everything in the next episode. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to drop a sub and hit that big boy bell. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace, peace.